Hey, this is John Williams with Battle Armor Designs, and today we're going to walk you through the fast and simple assembly instructions for the Battle Armor Designs Big Buck Plow 8 disc. What you'll see here laid out on the tailgate is what comes in the box. You'll have your disc already pre assembled on the hangers. You'll have two sets of four. You'll also have your crossbar that the disc mount to, as well as your height and depth adjusters and your hardware kit with U bolts and locking pins. Let's get after it. The first step in assembling your Big Buck Plow is to take the U bolts that have come with your bolt kit and your 916 locking nuts and hand tighten those. Start with the top nuts first. These are easily accessible by your hand. However, on your bottom nuts, it is a helpful tool to get a 12 inch extension in your 916 socket to get those started for yourself. Once you've made it this far and have all your nuts on your U-bolts hand tightened, you wanna align your disc hanger, the outside disc hanger be roughly one inch to one and a half inches away from the outside of your crossbar. Then you can grab your drill and socket and begin tightening your nuts down. Once you've finished tightening down your nuts to your U-bolts, you're going to use the same steps to attach the disc to the other side of the cross member. Then we're going to move on to installing our height and depth receiver hitch. Always start with the majority of your holes going down the vertical on your cross member. When you're starting to plow, you always want to start at the minimum depth possible where the discs are just barely touching the ground to prevent any harm to your machine. Once you've got that in place, slide your 5 8 pin through the hole. Use a cotter pin to secure that. Then attach it to your machine and you're ready to start plowing. 